This year, the Faculty of Humanities and Education has made special arrangements to recognize their top performers for 2019-2020 at the Faculty's first virtual tribute ceremony. They are what makes the humanities and education legacy so impactful and transformative. Welcome to the Faculty of Humanities and Education Tribute Ceremony to our students. Be present, dream on. To all our students, parents, heads of departments, staff, thank you for joining us today to pay tribute to our Faculty of Humanities and Education's most outstanding students. Let's take this time to hear from the Dean of the Faculty, Dr. Heather Cato, as she brings greetings. Congratulations, students. I have been speaking at our faculty's prize-giving ceremonies since 1998. I don't think there was ever more meaning behind the simple but heartfelt expression of congratulations than there is today. It has been quite a year, and I see this with the eyes of a historian. There are, however, these transformative and often difficult moments in all historical periods. They are challenging, yes, but they make us pause and think. These periods also open our eyes and our minds. In these periods also, very special people rise to the forefront. People many of us did not even realize were so special. People who did not even realize what they had within themselves. This past year, just being present and dreaming took on new meaning. I therefore want to acknowledge our students who made tremendous sacrifices to be present. I want to recognize our students who never stopped dreaming. I want to pay tribute to our students today who excelled in these very difficult times. Students, you personify the best of the heart of the UB graduate. Awkward quotations inspire us with the depth of the words but you inspire us with the depth of your souls. By your actions, you have shown us that life isn't about waiting for a storm to pass. It's about learning to dance in the rain. And right now I'm seeing my DCFA students. Further, in this time of turbulence and change, you are indeed living proof that knowledge is power. It must be our base. So continue to dance, to sing, to make films, to paint, to write books, to analyze our history and culture, to create and innovate, to educate others, to understand our languages and master communication with them. Continue to assist the disadvantaged. Continue to dare to be different with your choices. Continue to do this all with the highest standard. Continue to be the conscience of our communities. Local, regional, and international events continue to make it clear that the disciplines in the humanities and educations are needed more than ever. Let your education in the humanities be the tunnel through which you bring light to the world. We look to you to change our world. You have started with a bang. You tackled a pandemic and won. Just think about the possibilities to the future. I can't end without special words of thanks to the FHA team. I can think of no better group of staff members, academic, administrative or support to have on your side. Congratulations once again. Good day everyone. What a wonderful celebratory day today is. It is the day that the University of the West Indies St. Augustine campus 
recognizes excellence among its undergraduate students. The Distinguished Department of Literatures in English, of which I'm very proud to be an alumna, has identified you, our prize winners, as demonstrating the excellence to which it expects every one of its students to strive. That you have been acknowledged to have attained that standard is a fitting reward for the investment of time, dedication and serious commitment that you have devoted to your studies. I congratulate every one of you. I wish you continued success in your studies and I look forward to the outpouring of literary criticism, analysis, creative writing, poetry and prose that I'm certain will come from you, not only as you move onward and upward as a student at St. Augustine, but as you move on. I wish you every success in the future. Best wishes. Thank you, President Obama and Mrs. Obama for including me in this very special day. And congratulations to the class of 2020 Sorry, wrong script. Hi guys! Sorry for the um, maybe a little mix up there. Um, major congrats to all the prize winners and all the people graduating this year. You all have a Caribbean education in film, which I mean I think it's rare. You'll have access to you'll have had access to films and readings and work that a lot of people even at the most prestigious institutions probably never even thought about seeing or you know studying and I think that makes you pretty badass and a cut above the rest. If you ask me, I mean. <laughs> so um, go out there, make your mark on the world, make some impactful work, and make your parents proud, the Caribbean proud, and most importantly, yourself proud. Bye. We now pay tribute to the following students. The faculty recognizes Shania Hackshaw, Most Outstanding Bachelor of Arts Student, Level 1. Faith Ramlal, Most Outstanding Bachelor of Arts Student, Level 2. Samantha Joseph, Most Outstanding Bachelor of Arts Student, Level 3. Anjali Budu, most Outstanding Bachelor of Education student, Level 1. Savani S. Maharaj, Most Outstanding Bachelor of Education student, Level 2. Phaedra Mohammed, Most Outstanding Bachelor of Education student, Level 3. We now pay tribute to the following students who have topped the Faculty of Humanities and Education Foundation and University courses. Joshua Gadraj, English for Academic Purposes. Sherry Hines, Argument and Report Writing. Tanil Ramsawak, Writing About Literature. Brian Jordan, Scientific and Technical Writing. Sarah Hosein, Academic English for Research Purposes. Selena Bessel, Writing in the Visual, Performing and Carnival Arts. Janine Lovero, Caribbean Civilization. Riyad Mohammed, Caribbean Studies. Rinalia Bedesi, Caribbean Studies paper on an Indian topic. Natalia Manet, Caribbean Studies paper on an African topic. And now bringing greetings to you, our students, the Director of the Center for Language Learning, Dr. Beverly Ann Carter. I would like to offer my congratulations to the winners or prize winners over eight different languages 
who have excelled in their language study in the 2019-2020 academic year. We're very proud of you. You continue to represent the CLL in your devotion and excellence to language study, and we celebrate you on this occasion. The Center for Language Learning pays tribute to Nicholas Millington, Level 1 Chinese. Dejana Matthews, Level 1 French. Jovel Lewis, Level 2 French. Robert Beard, Level 3 French. Ruth Ramkali, Level 1 German. Nicola Lumsden, Level 2 German. Joshua Lambert, Level 1 Hindi. Kosi Regis, Level 1 Japanese. Richard Pargus, Level 2 Japanese. Aidan Roberts, Level 3 Japanese. David Dionorain, Level 1 Spanish. Justin Metivere, Level 2 Spanish. Keithan Allen, Level 3 Spanish. Joanna Macmillan, Level 1 Yoruba. Simone McBurney, Level 2 Yoruba. The head of the Department of Creative and Festival Arts, Mr. Louis McWilliams, brings greetings to you, our students. Pleasant good evening. Let me begin by wishing everyone a Happy New Year with special greetings to all the prize winners and recipients of first class honors at the Faculty of Humanities and Education. It is with a great sense of pride that I sit here in my office at the CFA and I'm very happy to be here in this physical space to send you congratulatory wishes. This evening, as we celebrate your achievements and excellence, I want you to reflect on your process during the time of study and the sacrifices that you made to get to this point. We at the CFA acknowledge your work and discipline because I know that we challenge you in both artistic and academic endeavors. And guess what? You pull through. So to those of you that achieve excellence at certificate level, I congratulate you. And I look forward to you continuing your work at the degree level. To the recipients of awards at the degree levels in dance, music, theater, visual arts, carnival studies, I give thanks for the work. And to those of you, this special bunch, uh, graduating with first class honors, on behalf of all of the staff at the CFA, I congratulate you wholeheartedly on this milestone. Keep striving for more, and remember to trust the process. And what do we say? DCFA! The Department of Creative and Festival Arts pays tribute to Faith Ramlal for excellence in Year 2, Visual Arts. Nimai Ali, Best Visual Arts Certificate Student, Art and Design. Zariah Pegas, Best Drama Theatre and Education Certificate Student. Jamila Gomez, Best Technical Theatre Production Certificate Student. Cyan Charles, Best Dance and Dance Education Certificate Student. Keon Batiste, Best Music Certificate Student. Samantha Joseph, Best Music Arts Degree Student. Destiny Blank, Best Visual Arts Degree Student, Fine Arts. David Niels, Best Visual Arts Degree Student, Design. Noraya Alfred, Best Theatre Arts Degree Student.
Christy Marie Madre, Best Carnival Arts Degree Student. Colette Boney, Excellence in Final Project, Certificate Drama, Theatre in Education. Christy Marie Madre, Best Caribbean Cultural Studies Student, Festival Project. Samantha Joseph, Best All-Round Student. And now bringing greetings to you, our students, the head of the Department of History, Dr. Sherry Ann Singh. On behalf of the Department of History, I extend heartiest congratulations to all prize winners today, especially to those who excelled in the study of history. This past year has seen tremendous transformation in teaching and learning at the UWI, which presented many challenges and called for flexibility, determination, and strength of purpose. You have not just risen to the challenge, but have excelled, and your achievements have placed you at the forefront of this historic period. We are so very proud of you and wish you continued success in your professional and academic journeys. Once again, congratulations. The Department of History pays tribute to Dylan Constantine, History of the West Indies. Aliyah Warian, History of the West Indies. Jamie Sullivan, African Civilization Shalice Luke, History of Africa Aileen Alexis, African Diaspora Brett Tomu, Heritage Studies Elizabeth Timothy, Foundations of South Asian Civilization Daryl Gransam, South Asian History. Dylan Constantine, History of the United States of America. Ruel McIntosh, History of the United States of America. Dylan Constantine, Excellence in Imperialism since 1918. Sharice Luke, Topics in the History of Trinidad and Tobago Andrew Dodan, Capitalism and Slavery Thalia Vidal, From Monroe to Castro Cynthia Bajan, Latin American History Chelsea Matura, Most Outstanding Level 1 History Student Ruel McIntosh, Most Outstanding Level 2 History Student. Shalice Luke, Most Outstanding Level 3 History Student. Clara Mohamed Foucault here. De la France Lointaine, j'ai le privilège de vous saluer. Lors de cette cérémonie importante qui marque un tournant dans votre vie, pendant quelques années, vous avez acquis de nouvelles connaissances, beaucoup de culture dans tous les domaines, mais vous avez surtout enrichi votre vie personnelle. Donc, euh, au moment où vous vous préparez à faire la transition entre votre vie d'étudiant, votre vie d'étudiante et la vie professionnelle, permettez-moi de vous adresser mes félicitations les plus chaleureuses du fond du cœur. Je souhaite, je souhaite que votre chemin de vie, que vos chemins de vie soient lumineux. Lumineux et prometteurs de nouvelles occasions de vous réaliser pleinement. Un grand bravo à tous. Congratulations, graduates, on your well-earned achievement. I'm sure Today is another of many proud, successful moments for you. It was said that every accomplishment starts with the decision to try, so I encourage you to never stop trying. You will continue to surpass any perceived limits once you believe you can, once you think there is a way. I cannot wait to see how you will shape the future, and I wish you only the best. There's something to do any day 
I will know right away soon as it shows. It may come cannonballing down through the sky, gleam in its eye, bright as a rose. It's only just out of reach, down the block, on a beach, under a tree. I got a feeling there's a miracle due, gonna come true, coming to me. Could it be? Yes, it could. Something's coming, something good, if I can wait. Something's coming, I don't know what it is, but it is gonna be great. With a click, with a shock, for no jingle, door or knock, open the latch. Something's coming, don't know when, but it's soon, catch the moon, one hand it Around the corner Or whistling down the river Come on, deliver Will it be? Yes, it will Maybe just by holding still be there. Come on, something, come on in. Don't be shy. Need a guide. Pull up a chair. The air is humming, and something great is coming. Down the block, on a beach, maybe tonight. And now, bringing greetings to you, our students, the head of the Department of Literary, Cultural and Communication Studies, Professor Paula Morgan. Greetings, awardees of the Department of Literary, Cultural and Communication Studies. You have made it through a challenging period and you have excelled. The fact that you are being honored in this award ceremony today means that the many hurdles that you have had to overcome have not stood in the way of your pursuit and accomplishment of excellence. None can deny that the events of the past year have changed the nature of our world. The long term toll of COVID 19 virus is yet to be assessed, and that is COVID 19. Who knows what awaits in terms of variants of the virus? Inept political leadership. The outworking of human self-centeredness, greed, stupidity, financial crises, environmental calamities, and the list continues. Seasons like these, in which unprecedented becomes commonplace, test the metal of the human spirit. I'm not discouraged, because there is an indomitable capacity within us as humans which cannot flourish in times of ease and comfort. The element of the human spirit that makes us capable of breaking records as soon as they are set, of being resilient and courageous in the face of grimace adversities is what comes to the fore in seasons like these. This is why the author Charles Dickens reminded us that the worst of times can be also the best of times. In a sense, the world which many of you are being handed at the cusp of your adult life is shaping up to be quite different from the one you were led to expect. I'm confident that you are well able. Our communal and family histories of transcendence will serve you in good stead. Being intelligent, resourceful, adaptable, resilient and determined will set you on the right trajectory. Moral integrity, generosity of heart and good humor will carry you along the way. Faith and wisdom will usher you triumphantly to the end of your pathway. Hearty congratulations on your accomplishment and God's speed of the next stage of life's wild and wonderful adventure. The Department of Literary, Cultural and Communication Studies pays tribute to Chelsea Mohammed, Best Level 1 Student in Communication Studies. Melissa Phillip, Best Level 2 Student in Communication Studies. Sonali Suknanan, 
Best Level 3 student in Communication Studies. Best Communication Studies thesis group for written presentation and also for video presentation. Petrina Jofield, Traven Lane Bailey, Avian Ogilvy, Shada Ramcharita, and Aileen Emily Savage. Katyan Ali, Introduction to Prose Fiction, Level 1. Sai Sonali and Molsing, Introduction to Poetry, Level 1. Rishad Hossain, Traditional British Poetry, Level 2. Renessa Neptune, Traditional British Poetry, Level 2. Jolie Wong, Traditional British Poetry Level 2 Keston Paul Shakespeare Studies Rashad Hussain Modern American Literary Prose Rashad Hussain Creative Writing Poetry Rashad Hussain Creative Writing Prose Gabriel Blackman, African Literature. Sophia Hoyt, Modern Literature Level 3. Rashad Hussain, West Indian Literature Level 3. Nicole Sukai, Indian Literature Level 3. The head of the Department of Modern Languages and Linguistics, Professor Elizabeth Walcott Hackshaw, brings greetings to you, our students. Hello, everyone. Uh, my name is Elizabeth Walcott Hackshaw. I am the new head of Modern Languages and Linguistics. You may know the previous head, Dr. Nicole Roberts. I am here to congratulate our students, prize winners of the last academic year. Um, you've done very well. We are all proud of you, lecturers, staff, everyone. And we congratulate you on doing so well during such a difficult and challenging year. So please continue to enjoy your success, continue to work hard, and to continue to dream on. Thank you. The Department of Modern Languages and Linguistics pays tribute to students. Lois Seely, Most Outstanding Level 1 French Language Student. Liselli Raphael, Most Outstanding Level 2 French Language Student. Riyad Mohammed, Most Outstanding Level 3 French Language Student. Chloe Maharaj, Most Outstanding Level 1 French Literature Student. Liselli Raphael, Most Outstanding Level 2 French Literature Student. Ariane Lopez, Most Outstanding Level 3 French Literature Student. Malaika Cooper, Most Outstanding Level 1 Linguistic Student. Jesse Souknarain, Most Outstanding Level 2 Theoretical Linguistic Student. Top Performers in Linguistics Research, Elisa Bimlal. Corey Noyan. Sati Manik Leah Elliott, Most Outstanding Student in French Lexicon Creole, Patois Ariane Lopez, Most Outstanding Level 2 Linguistics Student and Top Performer in Caribbean Linguistics and Rihanna Passard, Best Level 1 Portuguese Language Student Thalia Vidal, Best Level 2 Portuguese Language Student. Nazare Reis, Top Performer in Brazilian Culture. Charlene Choate, Most Outstanding Student, Spanish Level 1. Kathy Jo Winchester, Most Outstanding Student, Spanish Level 2. Laila Abdul Latif, Most Outstanding Student, Spanish Level 3. Natalia Manette, Top Performer in Hispanic Literature, Peninsula. 
Cheyenne Lee, top performer in culture and society in Latin America. Miriam Mohammed, tribute for Spanish. My name is Vladimir Lucian and I'm sending a huge congratulations to all the young literary scholars who are receiving awards at the award ceremony, hoping to hear and read great things about you in the future. Hello, my name is Marlon De Beek and I'm the Chief Executive Officer here at the Naprima Bowl in San Fernando. And I would like to extend my congratulations to you, the graduating class of 2020 Department of Creative and Festival Arts. As an alumna myself of the department, I studied a major in Carnival Studies with a minor in Communications. What DCFA did for me was really prepare me, giving me all the tools that I require to work in the industry. I worked as a cultural officer at the Ministry of Culture whilst I was studying the Carnival Arts degree. Whilst it was challenging, I was able to apply what I learned at the university to my daily job. At this time in the industry, we need people like you, you artists, you creators, you designers, to continue contributing to the creative sector. Here at the Naprima Bowl, we have a long history with the Department of Creative and Festival Arts. And we look forward to hosting you in the future, whether it's as educators, performers, designers, and even producers, creating your work to present here at the Naprima Bowl. Hey everyone, I just want to say congratulations on your well-deserved awards. 2020 was an extremely difficult year for the entire world, specifically the film world. So it's a testament to your hard work that you could achieve greatness in spite of all the chaos. That's something you should be extremely proud of. Good luck in all your future endeavors and I can't wait to see what amazing films you will make next. The Director of School of Education, Professor Jerome Delisle, brings greetings to you, our students. I bring greetings and congratulations from the School of Education. I am Professor Jerome Delisle, Director of the School. There's always a time to celebrate. Perhaps that celebration is even more appropriate when we have worked hard and achieved a key goal. Excelling in some field of endeavor is truly a beautiful thing. You know, many of you have extended yourselves and have conquered environments and barriers, showing true resilience. To excel amidst turbulence and strife, we congratulate all who will receive awards tonight and extend those congratulations to your families and friends. The School of Education pays tribute to Pedro Mohammed, most outstanding Bachelor of Education student. The School of Humanities pays tribute to our cross-departmental programs in English language and literature with education. Karishma Peters, most outstanding level one student. Shaquila Sylvester, most outstanding level two student. Onisha Hughes, Most Outstanding Level 3 Student. The coordinator of the film unit, Mr. Robert Yao Ramasa, brings greetings to you, our students. Let me say how proud we are of you for all your achievements, particularly in this trying time. You have shown resolve, resilience, agility. You've innovated and you have stayed completely focused and not been thrown off your path. We look forward to your achievements to come and the significant role that you will play in leading your generation to greater heights and triumph as you go into the future. The future, of course, being now. Again, it was with great pride that we salute you. All that you have done, especially in these times. Congratulations all. 
Haira Hussain, Most Outstanding Student in Film Production, Level 1. Yadel Baksh, Most Outstanding Level 1 Student in Film Studies and Best Overall Level 1 Film Student. Amon Del Samson, Most Outstanding Level 2 Student in Film Production, Best All-Round Production. Amon Del Samson is also the Most Outstanding Overall Level 2 Film Student. Ijaz Ramdani, Most Outstanding Student in Film Studies, Level 2. Alan Chan, Most Outstanding Student in Film Production, Level 3. David Paris, Most Outstanding Student in Film Studies, Level 3 and Overall Level 3 Film Student. The Faculty of Humanities and Education pays tribute to Kezia Hoggins for community service. Hi everybody, um, my name is Trumaine Lamy and I am a proud graduate of GCFA. I majored in Theatre Arts and Communication Studies. Um, congrats, 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 congrats! class of 2019 2020 you did it um, in the midst of this crazy pandemic um, you got through you made it to the finish line all the determination tenacity and dedication it all paid off with the sweat and the tears and I'm sure a little bit of blood as well um, the deadlines all of the late nights and everything it all paid off it all paid off and you are here now to proudly stand as a graduate that you'll be of DCFA like myself. Um, now you are part of this prestigious group and that we get to go around and proudly represent our, our institution that we are from. And so I just want to impart great congratula um, congratulations and well wishes to you um, and all the best for future endeavors. Bye bye. I am Amrit Sabu, holder of a bachelor's degree in musical arts from the Department of Creative and Festival Arts in the Faculty of Humanities and Education. I'm the co-founder, leader, and musical director of the Supernova Steel Orchestra and a member of the National Steel Symphony Orchestra of Trinidad and Tobago. I would like to extend a hearty congratulations to all of the FHE honorees and graduating students in accomplishing this great feat. I am positive that like me, your experiences and interactions with staff and fellow students during your time of study shall serve you well as you continue on your journey into academic and professional life. Once again, congratulations. Greetings everyone. Congratulations. You know, my granny always used to say almost anything can be achieved with some discipline and the right attitude. Today, your right attitude, your discipline, your dedication, your perseverance stands as testimony to that thing that my granny believed in. I want to take this moment to personally congratulate you on a job well done. This is your moment. My name is Rayshawn Pierre. In 2018, I was the faculty valedictorian and I was also a recipient of the George Bailey, Earl Warner and Beryl McBurney prizes Effectively. Oh, winning is a wonderful thing. And winning comes with a particular type of responsibility. So as you sit on victory seat, I want you to always be conscious of how you will continue to inspire generations and how you will add to the knowledge stock of our space with your magnificence and your brilliance. And you're doing so as you stand on the legacy and power of what I have always regarded as a groundbreaking faculty and department. This is your moment. Breathe in it. Sing glory in it. Celebrate it. I am so proud of you. You deserve this. The Faculty of Humanities and Education now pays tribute to our first class honor students. Elizabeth Gray, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Communication Studies. 
Eileen Emily Savage, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Communication Studies. Michael Solomon, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Communication Studies with Psychology. Siobhan Tull, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Communication Studies with Psychology. Chelsea Sanchez, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Communication Studies with International Relations. Shana Mohammed, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Communication Studies with Film Studies. Avian Ogilvy, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Communication Studies with Human Resource Management. Sunali Suknanan, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Communication Studies with Literatures in English. Carisha Douglas, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Communication Studies with Spanish. Celine Byron, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Double Major, Communication Studies and Management Studies. Shane Leakett, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Double Major, Film Production and Film Studies. David Paris, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Double Major, Film Production and Film Studies. Sean Siosaran, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Double Major, Film Production and Film Studies. Antonio Wallace, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Double Major, Film Production and Film Studies. Alan Chan, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Double Major, Film Production and Environmental Resource Management. Alyssa Ali, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, French with Spanish and International Relations. Riyad Mohammed, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, French with Spanish and International Relations. Shirley's Luke, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, History. Renalia Badesi, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, History with Anthropology. Akib Mohammed, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, History with Management Studies. Ariane Lopez, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Double Major Linguistics and French. Leah Elliott, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Linguistics with French. Vinaya Balbeer Singh, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Linguistics with Speech Language Pathology. Olayinka Ashby, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Literatures in English with Linguistics. Jolie Wong, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Literatures in English with Linguistics. Kareem Tinto, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Spanish. Keithan Allen, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Double Major, Spanish and Communication Studies. Laila Abdul Latif, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Double Major, Spanish and French. Natalia Manette, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Spanish with Communication Studies. Miriam Mohammed, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Spanish with Human Resource Management. Elon Purville, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Spanish with Linguistics. Jervan Rampasad, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Spanish with Linguistics. Danique Bailey, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Special, Musical Arts. Kiche Graves, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Special, Musical Arts. Leon Ince, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Special, Musical Arts. Michael Joseph, First Class Honors, 
Bachelor of Arts Special Musical Arts. Natasha Joseph, First Class Honors Bachelor of Arts Special Musical Arts. Samantha Joseph, First Class Honors Bachelor of Arts Special Musical Arts. Brandon Punwasi, First Class Honors Bachelor of Arts Special Musical Arts. Andrew Samlal, First Class Honors Bachelor of Arts Special Musical Arts. Naraya Alfred, First Class Honors Bachelor of Arts Theatre Arts. Rachel Henry, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Theatre Arts. Nishad Mohammed, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Theatre Arts. Shelby Utah, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Theatre Arts. Chantel Williams, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Theatre Arts. Sagel Bascom, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Special Visual Arts. Leah Clark, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Special Visual Arts. David Niels, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Special Visual Arts. Ananda Poon, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Special Visual Arts. Chrishell Williams, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Arts, Special Visual Arts. Phaedra Mohammed, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Education, Primary General. Daisha Oliver, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Education, Primary General. Victoria Woodley, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Education, Primary General. Chloe Manuel, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Education, Primary General. Daisha Henry, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Education, Primary General. Catherine Sigobin, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Education, Primary General. Sarah Suku, First Class Honors, Bachelor of Education, Primary General. And now we have come to the close of the 2019-2020 Tribute Ceremony. The Faculty of Humanities and Education congratulates all who have been recognized. You have made us proud.